there's really only two reasons in my experience that we don't take action. Okay. Okay. Reason number one. So if you have ever not taken an action and on something you said you were going to do, this is for you. Um, number one, either the things on your list, you actually don't care about. So you have to be honest. So sometimes we put things on our goal list, like I'm going to, you know, whatever, make whatever level, or I'm going to lose 50 pounds, or I'm going to forgive my mother. And you actually don't want to. So you have to be honest and go, you know what, did I just write that goal down? Cause it sounded good. And I was at my mastermind and everybody else had a goal like that. So I, I wrote that down. I said, I'm going to work out every day, but I, I don't want to don't stop playing, but maybe have play time and work time. And so when you have your work time, you like, that's time to work. So I would look at your goals and say, are these my goals really? What am I serious about them? And if it's no, then take those off your list. Cause they're just making, they're just making you feel bad about yourself for not doing them. So if you don't care about them goals, X them. Perfect time to burn out all the goals that you don't, you're not, you don't care about. So let's say you've got some goals. You look at that. You're like, no, I love my goals. I love my to-do list. I, I care about all those things on it. Then it's not a case of, of if you don't care about it. It's a case that you're not in the habit of taking action on those things. And the only way to do that is to just, again, it's just back to your habits. It's to schedule your work time and you look at your list and and this is where that word comes in of joy. Okay. So I want you to think of all the ways you want to have joy, right? So a joyful life, joyful friendships, a joyful business, right? And a joyful business, by the way, is one that makes you money. That's a joyful business. Otherwise it's just a joyful hobby because if your business doesn't pay your bills, that's, there's, what's the joy of that? Then you have a joyful volunteer. So if you are actually in business and you want your business to be joyful, it must be cash flowing. If you're serious about having a joyful business, then you have to be serious about creating habits that, that, that get that business where it needs to be. It's not a sexy coaching answer. It's really, it's really simple. You just have to commit to doing it. Sort of like if you want to work out, you want to have a physique, you know, that you, you know, whatever you actually have to work at it. There is no shortcut to that. You just have to commit.